After a dedicated teaching career, Rees Bench had taught high school chemistry to over 3,000 students. In his last year, this dedicated teacher inspired a student with an idea. The student was Dr. Raj. The idea was the invention of the hydrogen car. Mr. Bench traveled with his student to the International Science Fair in Dallas, Texas, where the project won the Gold and Silver Award. As a freshman in college, Dr. Raj received funding from the Ford Motor Company to continue his hydrogen energy research. He went on to become a pioneer of hydrogen energy technology, developing and operating hydrogen cars, buses, and even living in the world's first hydrogen homestead. The major breakthrough came when Dr. Raj invented the modern hydrogen fuel cell car. This pollution-free vehicle greatly increased the efficiency over the hydrogen engine and pioneered the current hydrogen fuel cell revolution. Today, hydrogen cars are entering into the market and will soon clear the smog from our cities, reduce global warming, and extend our planet's energy resources. A fuel cell car is refueled with hydrogen. The only emission is water. Honda just unveiled its newest car, the Clarity Fuel Cell. It's powered by electricity that's generated when hydrogen and oxygen are combined. With hydrogen being the most abundant chemical element in the universe, there is a plentiful supply. Hyundai are the world's first manufacturer to take a fuel cell electric vehicle into mass production. If you were to create a wish list for the perfect car, you would want a fuel source based on an element that's the most plentiful in the universe, and that is hydrogen. Dr. Raj has emerged as a technological leader of our time. It was 50 years ago when I invented the first hydrogen car. It's been a long time, but it's so gratifying to me to see this technology now beginning to be used all around the world. I am so grateful to my teachers, to my educators that helped me have the vision to be able to dream an idea like this and the knowledge to be able to put it on the street and to make it happen. Sometimes I, I wonder if school administrators realize the impact they're having on the individual lives of their students as they create a good, wholesome environment for education and as they motivate and inspire teachers to be their best. The minds, the ambitions, and the education of these young people will impact what they can dream and what they will achieve in their lives. And that is the future of this great country. It's just impossible to realize how important every single effort we make for education is in terms of the future of this planet.